everyone! Welcome back to a new nail art tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how to create this pink glittery emoji nail art I created for my birthday. I went for something happy and fun, so let's get started! Begin to apply a nice base coat followed by a coral nail polish. You can start off with any color of your choice. I love colors so much but you feel free to use any color you'd like. Now prepare a very light pink color and apply it to a foam brush like shown. With the foam brush technique, we are going to make a pretty background. When you are done, make sure to clean up the excess and add a layer of a glittery nail polish. This nail polish is Ice Pop by Sally Hansen. I just can't get enough of it. It's so beautiful, isn't it? For the emoji faces, you're going to need a yellow nail polish as a base color. With the help of a dotting tool, we're creating the faces. If you don't have a dotting tool, of course you could try to replace it with a big bobby pin or the back of a pen will do too. While this is drying, prepare red and black gray paint. Now to outline the faces, I'll be using this striper brush and I'll be working with this nail art brush for details as well. So outline each face with red paint. Now, with black acrylic paint, let's create some sunglasses and a big smile. Another idea could be to draw a face like blowing a kiss, I think it's very funny. Another idea is to draw the classic happy emoji smiling. I believe this is the most well known. And the last idea could be to make a pretty smile, but instead of making the eyes as dots, you're going to create two hearts to express the in love feeling. This is one of the emojis I probably use the most. Alright, so now you need just to make sure everything got dried up before applying a good top coat. And that's it! Finish up with a comb for your lasting manicure and you're done! So here's the final look! I hope you enjoyed this tutorial, thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more if you haven't already! Bye and see you in my next Nellar tutorial!